One, two, three. Yay! Content SMP! Yay. Let's go! Content SMP day one! This is my Minecraft SMP called Content SMP. I named it this way because me and other modders on it can code mods for the server as it goes on, hence the content part. Now, this was day one. Everyone was just starting out, planning to have their fun, but I had something specific in mind. See, I've played my fair share of SMPs, and if there's one recurring thing I've noticed, is that constantly, as soon as people go to the end, the end of said SMP is generally very close. Now, I'm sure there's a psychological explanation that we could study to solve the issue, but uh, let's be honest, this is a Minecraft video, so I'm just gonna destroy every single end portal, and I'm gonna do it in survival. Here's my plan. We're gonna take out every single stronghold in this world in survival. But Ran, how are you gonna manage to destroy every end portal? There's like... A lot. See, when making the mod pack, we decided to include Young's Better Strongholds, a mod generating huge and magnificent strongholds, but we didn't want them to be too common, so I delved into the code and rewrote the generation. The way I made it work is simple. Instead of the vanilla multi-ring system, I instead make it generate one ring with three strongholds in a triangular fashion. And this is how I'm gonna be able to destroy every end portal. But first, I had to get geared up, and while doing so, something really interesting happened. Got carrots everywhere. It's lovely. Alright, uh, more onions, carrots, I don't know what that is. Fondy. Wait, what do you mean Fondy's here? There's no way Fondy's here. There's no way Fondy's here. What do you mean, hi Fondy? Are you guys joking about the fact that I'm a copycat of Fondy? I swear to God, I didn't see a single Fondy message. You guys are trolling me. Then again, I wasn't really looking at the chat that actively. Fondy's here, bullshit. Fondy, show yourself. If you are here, prove it. Prove it with different people. Yo, oh my God. Hello Fondy, how's it going? Oh, nice. <laughs> I can't believe this. Amazing. Incredible. This is really dreams come true. Anyway, I ended up venturing a bit further from spawn and started to come across modded structures and creatures. Pretty cool farmhouse with a horse near it. And there's a disc. We don't care about music, people. We're not the dream SMP here, all right? Yo, there's crows? Crows? Yo, there's crows. How's it called? Crow? A crow or crow? We're gonna call it Raven, right? I'll be simple. I know everything made that. Oh, it's so cute. I love it. It's like... It's like a flappy bird. Squirrels! Squeak, squeak. An hour in, I came across a rune portal, and it was finally time to go to the nether. Remember, we're speedrunning here, we're trying to get ender eyes. And that is exactly what we need. New technique, it's called the rat technique. Uh, it's absolutely not scientifically based. I feel like nobody's gone to the nether yet. All right, the goal now is to get red mushrooms, because we're gonna need those. I'm gonna do the coward technique called the boat technique, which is gonna consist of getting pearls this way. Wow, look at this, already one pearl. Probably the whole... Le Okay, I'm not gonna struggle for 10 hours. Uh, that's very good to know. All right, I feel like that should be enough. Yeah, that's definitely gonna be enough. All right, now we can concentrate on the pearls. Now that I had the required materials to go for the first stronghold, Aid decided he wanted to tag along with me. However, in his search to find me in the nether, he, um... Oh man, I already love this server. Right, now we just need to wait for 8. Back in the overworld, I decided to wait for 8, but after 15 minutes, he called me. And turns out, his situation was a bit more dire than I originally presumed it to be. Hello? Oh, hey, 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 how are you doing? I'm in such a pickle right now. So I'm a zombified piglin, and I can't swim in lava, and I just fell in lava, and I don't have any blocks to bridge out. Now, this one might require a bit of an explanation. See, when you die on this server, there's two way things can go. You either die the normal Vanilla Minecraft way, losing your items and just respawning, or you choose the alternate, more difficult path, which turns you into a ghost, which makes it so you have to possess an undead, which makes it so you have to cure yourself like a zombie villager. And eight chose this path. So he died in the nether and, you know, just decided to possess a random zombified piglin. Which means he was stuck and needed my help. Fine, I'll help you. I don't know the relation dynamics on the server, so I could always use an ally. So I went back and tried to find him. Oh, are you telling me I have to go back all this way? Oh no. I'm gonna help you because I like you, but I you will have to repay <laughs> the favor, all right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, I see a staircase to, uh, Oh uh, yeah, I'm currently breaking the portal that made me fall into lava because I went through, walked forward, expecting it to be the other portal I made, but it wasn't. It spawned over a lava lake. You're looking good, ain't there? <laughs> Yeah. I'm here, buddy. And turns out, Eight wasn't the only person who died in the nether and chose the difficult path. There's a uh, yeah, wall it is. here. Wait, it is. Yeah, I'm gonna make my way back to the portal. Was. Yo, there's a wither that just... Who the hell are you? You need to leave your... 
Well, naturally I offered her my help, but she wanted to get blaze rod, so she wanted to stay there. All right, let's leave Cammy to die here. Come follow me. Yeah, that was Cammy. Yeah. There's so many bridges already. What the hell? Oh, that's also my bridge. Oh my god. Let's go through here. Okay, so we're going the right way this way. This Requiem is so amazing sometimes, just watching people in the distance being their new self. Yay, I'm back in this plane of safety. Back in the overworld again. It was finally time to actually go for the first stronghold. I'm just gonna go to the strongholds. I have some unfinished business to do. I'll, I'll, I'll just be by your side. All right, you're my sidekick now. Do we want a side to join us as well? Among us? Hello, Asai. How's it going? I already know you're up to no good. Like, you, because you're right, you must be up to no good. Huh. People seem to be wary about what I'm doing. I may need to be careful about that. But anyway, me, Asai, and Eight met up together around the first stronghold. Oh, it's hello. This so -called oh, hello. No, it's somewhere here. It would be somewhere so here, I think. Uh, I'm gonna start digging now here. I keep digging, but I can't find anything. What the hell? It's gonna be really deep. Yeah, you're not even at deep flick yet. You're not gonna find anything. All right, yeah. there we go. There I'm we go. I'm above you. I was making a stair. I hate you now. You're on the other side of the stair. What happened? I died, I fell down, I died. This has to be one of the most anticlimactic, clumsy, and dumb deaths I have ever experienced. And of course, I'm gonna have to choose the difficult path, which means I now need to find a new body, a weakness potion, and a golden apple to get cured. Is there any mobs here? I can't see any mobs. Oh, there's a zombie here. Okay, perfect. All right, Requiem, here we go. Now, keep in mind, we're destroying the portals here. I don't know how people will react to this, so I decided to gear up a little bit more by just searching around the stronghold. All right, there's armor here. That's pretty good. There's armor and shield here. I, I What I want to say... If they are against us destroying the portal, we at least have an asset we can use. There's so many in here. But I was getting sidetracked. I still needed to get cured. And in order to do that, I needed a fermented spider eye for the weakness potion, which requires a brown mushroom, which I didn't have. So I did the most logical thing. I went and looked for one in the nether while I was getting the sugar. This is a grimly large one. Yeah, they're really cool. No one's ever complimented me. You wanna talk about it? Yeah. <laughs> Are you f <laughs> kidding me? I died again. Okay, now I'm something a little faster actually, and now I'm a skeleton, so. And eventually, after an entire hour, Looking for one. <gasps> oh! That sounds like you're requesting. One brown mushroom. One. Let's one go. brown mushroom. Just one. One brown mushroom in the middle of nowhere. This is amazing. Okay. Okay. Now I'm coming back. Die. All right. You don't look so buff now, eh? Look at your weak biceps. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I got weakness. I'm I'm drinking it now. Oh Zam, look at the shirtless eight sided square over there. Yo, look at that look at them ribs I got. There we go. Alright. We're under the process of getting killed. We just need to wait for the strength to run out. Yes. Yes. Alright, there yes. we go. Good as new, let's go! I feel, I was gonna say I feel good, but then Nojia kicked in and then I feel terrible. But then I feel good! Finally back on track, it was time to start my mission. Let's see that poor room. I'm kind of curious myself what it looks like. It looks oh, banging. It does look really cool. It is really, really interesting. Uh, are we actually gonna go to the end? Mm, yeah, we are. Wait, really? Oh, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> I see now. <laughs> I thought you were gonna do some weird piston contraptions and both break the portal, but that's genius! Wait, you knew my my goal? You were so dead set on the struggles and you said you were gonna be evil. I right, never we... said I would be evil. Hey, hey, send back. Why'd you do that? We could have gone to the end. What? You guys are just gonna leave. If you go through it, you're just gonna leave and never come back. I want that, and I want any of that. Can you stay away aside? Look at what I have in my hand, alright? You want that? No, what that is. You right. do want I that? Can't call it. That is lingering damage. You do not want that. So yeah, I, I, I don't want you guys to leave. Now I'll be on my way and I'll just go to uh, the other two strongholds. Thank you for tagging along. That was really nice. Also, hey, you still owe me, by the way. And just like this, before it could degenerate, I decided to make my escape. I therefore went through the portal, got rid of the potions I did not need anymore, and decided to travel through the Navo in order to arrive at a little village near spawn. This village is empty. What the hell? It's just the one zombie. Well, we're gonna, we're gonna sleep in the barn. That's what we'll do. All right, and this is where I decided to log off for the night. Terrible mistake. See, the village wasn't exactly abandoned. It was cleared by players to live in it. So when I woke up the next morning, all right, let's go. Um, I have no idea why I'm contained in this. Uh, whether I'm hearing, who the f are you? Listen here, I'm not paranoid nor a detective, but getting trapped in cobblestone and then getting splashed with weakness when you get out of it means anything. It's a trap. 
Oh my god, what the f Hey, I, I, go! Call me a red. Call me a red. Let's go. Oh my god, where are you, freak? Ow. Okay, that's uh. I already nearly died. <laughs> Alright, now we run! Well, I guess we have enemies now! Oh my god. And we need a water bucket. At the moment I reorganized my food to get ready to fight, I saw it. The one lingering damage potion that I forgot to throw out. This fight was now in my favor. You wanna fight me? Fight me like a man! Ow. Ow, ow, ow. ow. Yes! With people now actively trying to kill me, I figured it was time to lay low and actually get a bit further away from spawn. And when traveling to find a new place to hide, I came across a bunny castle. This is not a very good hunting place. Wait, what's that? Oh, that's a bunny castle! That's exactly what we want! Alright, so the goal uh, in this bunny castle is like there's a thousand mobs and spawners. Alright, so, uh, this is very risky, this is gonna be very, very risky, um, but I'm sure we can do it. Okay, the mountain generated in it, that's uh, not good. Alright, so we have a book and quill here. Count of Kerbanox last well! Count of Kerbanox last well. As I die, I leave my riches with, to my cute little bunny. It will forever live in this tombstone, but you must first access it with this riddle. You see me in a knoll, legs, tube coral, and orchids. What color am I? Wait, is tube coral blue? Blue? Orchids are blue? I'm gonna play by the rules. If I die here, I will f***ing blame every single one of you. And I will stop making videos. I swear to god, where is the entrance? Oh, it's here, okay. I'm scared to go against the bunny people. Give me some courage. Alright. Where is the bunny? Everything's burning. Holy f Oh, there's the- there's the bunny! Ah! Bunny! Ah, what the f is that speed? Holy sh! you're f***ing Goku. But how much health do you have? What the f Okay, I can understand why they removed it from the game. How much health do you have? Jesus f***ing Christ, what the Ah! Holy sh! Is it dead? I think it is. It's not! What the f? No! No, 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 no. F yes! Oh my fucking god! You are the worst fucking thing in. I please tell me there's not another one. I can't take two. I need. I need to breathe. I need. I need to breathe. And with the beast slain, it was time to turn his lair into an XP farm. And while doing so, I received an interesting message. And that message was from Arathain, basically telling me we need to talk. Get your ass over here. But I was still very under-equipped and I didn't know how kitted the other players were. So the next day before actually going there, I went to mine some netherite. Explosively. Alright. Netherite, let's go. Okay, one piece. Ooh, more than one. Holy sh- Okay. Netherite, let's go, baby. There's so much! Oh, fancy, fancy me. We're gonna get covered in debris. Now that I was probably geared up, I decided to use Kami and Upcraft's railway that went from their base to spawn because their base happened to be very close to mine. Alright, good luck. Thank you very much, bye! Okay, I think we may be arriving soon enough. The lodestone compass seems to be pointing the way we're going. Okay, we're at spawn. That, that changed quite a bit since last time I've been there. Yo, that looks cool! That looks... my... amazing! Wait, 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 what? It goes... it starts... down here? What? Hello, my dear friend. Oh, you f I don't know if you can call me friend just yet, but you just scared me. So, right. uh, welcome to Bonesboro. Well, thank you. Oh, so that's where the compass leads. Oh, I see. I like the lighting here, and, uh... I like the statue. Let us <laughs> go upstairs. Can. Okay. Uh, Moria, could you get the roast chicken? Please enter the banquet hall. Yo, you've got a banquet and, uh, hall? Yo! Take a seat. Why is <laughs> 8 in the voice chat now? <laughs> uh, all that aside. Um, uh, ah, I, 
I, I am. <laughs> Turns out, Eight had been tailing me from Kami and Upcraft's base, but since he joined the voice chat, I knew who was invisible. Just reveal yourself, I saw you, Eight. All I have to say is that, uh, Bonesboro much appreciates the general theme of your actions. I just Damn. realized I've been muted. Yeah, <laughs> of course, because you're trying to sneak around, but it's still obvious. What are you doing here? Uh, ooh. Ah. So you want to help me, hypothetically speaking, if I were to go destroy the last two portals, would you be one to accompany me in my quest? And if I do ever find opponents on the way? Uh, why not? Oh, you're already kidding. I guess let's do it. Can I follow you? Sure you can if you want. <laughs> I, I think, I you think, can I tag think along. You, you've kind of already been doing <laughs> yeah, you've been doing that without my consent anyway, so... With my newly made friends, we were now going for the second stronghold. However, coming out of Bonesboro, I received another message. Rat, a raven just appeared and this is for you. So many book and quills. Come alone, come unarmed. Yeah, like I was gonna fall for that. So naturally, we decided to go to that location. All four of us, fully armored, ready, and expecting trouble. Alright, there is a house here. And there is a sigh on top of it. Hello, can you hear us? Hello, Asai. Uh, look, I I know you said come come alone, come un unarmed, but uh, I I feel like I didn't know it was you, and uh, I feel like that's a bit ominous. Where's the money? Stop! Stop! No! Don't point your weapons at him! Stop! Oh, I wanted to talk, rat. Well, I wanted to talk about what? Something with me. What is it with people wanting to see me and then deciding to go upstairs? Look, there's even a baby creeper that wants to negotiate with us. Look, it's. <laughs> <laughs> no! No! I see. I see we've had a bit of a, a, a troubled time together so far. I want to ask you about your motives for destroying the portals. I think I've made it clear through multiple encounters with people, but... Yeah, three head. Yeah, yeah exactly. but I'm not people. Shut the fuck, Moria. <laughs> You're not supposed to be here in the first place. <laughs> I think I already told you when I was with you in 8. The end is always that one thing that people rush to in the start of an SMP and just, you know, you get elytras, you get chalker boxes, you get cool stuff. And that's nice, but apart from that... What's the end? It's the end and that's it. That's what I don't want. I don't want the end. I see. My relationships with other people have uh, broken apart and I can see your reasoning. Do you need any help? Turns out in the meantime of me laying low, making my XP farm and getting kitted with netherite, Lux and Asai had already gone to the second stronghold and Lux and Trust decided to open the portal. But Asai and Lux disagreed on their stances to go to the end and here we are. Heading all together to the second stronghold guarded by Lux and Trust with the hired help of Zombie with the intent of stopping me destroying the portals. I was at the stronghold earlier. Zombie and Lux are holding off the portal. They've got full netherite in the champs. It's nothing we can't take on, honestly. Uh -huh. Wait, let's be honest here, we're four versus two. What is gonna happen? Asai, I assume you know the way to the portal because that's what I understood from what you said. Yes. Okay then, let's get to it. So together we headed to the second stronghold and now it was time to infiltrate. Oh, it's here. I see. In we go. Yo, nice. Let's go then, let's get, let's get this show on the road. Aye. Portal room is down the stairs to the right. Down the stairs to the right? Are you sure this is gonna go behind it? Well, no, this won't go behind it, so go straight to it. Okay, do you sure? Because you wanted to us to surprise them. I guess we're going in then! Right, I suggest you go through this wall. Eh? Hey, why do you do this? I do a little trolling. That is not good, that is not good, that is not good. Oh, there's a lush cave here. Oh, there there's a lush cave. Oh wait, is this the poor room? I don't know if this is the poor room, but I'm destroying it. No, wait, they don't do Yeah, we didn't exactly get time to start a discussion and uh, kind of jumped to violence. However, after Lux interest killed Arathane and also accidentally killed our friend Asai, things quickly calmed down, allowing us to talk it through. Well, I mean the others, because I'm just gonna destroy the portal sneakily while they have their little chat. We sent the bird and it didn't came out. You're just we don't know how it works. That's how it works. There's a dragon back there. Brad's goal is to prevent the, the server from dying. When we go to the end and beat the dragon, we're gonna get OP stuff and then we're just gonna get more of the server and leave. That's that's his idea, at least as I understand it. I, I didn't need to bring it. Keep going, Rack, keep going. It's gone. I 
Oh, well, oh, oh, I mean, the portal's gone. I He's feel so fine. relieved. I don't exactly understand how and when we stopped fighting, because you literally bombarded everybody in this room. I, I didn't mean to kill Asai. I, did, I didn't know Asai was with you guys. He led us here because he was against you protecting it. We fought for nothing. Okay. You let me destroy the portal in the end. We fought for nothing. And Asai died for nothing. I'll just go to the last stronghold myself. We've spilled enough blood. If you guys understand why I'm doing this, I'm gonna do this alone. I feel like that's better. I'm going and I don't want anybody following me. With two strongholds gone, I just had to find the last one. And that was gonna be a piece of cake. Remember, since they generate on a ring in a triangular fashion, if I know where two strongholds are, I can know the general direction of the third. So that's what I did. I put two dots on the map, approximated where the third stronghold should be, and started heading this way. It's northeast. So let's go. Okay, so it's going down somewhere here and... Well, that's awfully practical. Are you kidding me? Cobblestone in a very deep hole? Somebody's been here. But the thing is, I wasn't expecting any resistance for this stronghold. But nonetheless, I got into it and stayed on my guard. There's somebody here, definitely. Oh, there it is. Okay, we found it. Now, I'm... What the hell are you doing here? Are you alone? Okay, cool. So I'm just gonna do my own thing here. Do you know what you're doing, Rat? Do you know what happens when things don't die when you're supposed to? They become undead. Yeah, that's the story of Requiem. We have this mod on the server, so yeah, I do know. No, no, Rat, you don't understand. When you destroy that end portal, you'll be indefinitely prolonging this world's life. When things don't die, they mutate, they fester, and they suffer very, very slowly. A story of my life. Rat, if you break this portal, you're killing everyone in this server. You're dooming them. Hey, look, look, the aggravating factor of every SMP that ends up dying is just going to the end. What are you trying to tell me? I know it's horrible that they died, but if you destroy this portal, something far worse is going to happen to all of us. Ooh, sweet, ominous, menacing lore. I love it. Now, I didn't exactly know what I wanted to do in that situation, so uh, I just referred to my live stream chat. If she is right, is that really what I want? What if, instead of destroying it, we just kept it hidden? and just played the mind game. Yes, I could gatekeep it. That's the thing. The best of both worlds. People not going to the end, and I still, in case there is an issue, in case I need the end portal, I have it. Let's do that and keep it. And so on that decision, I sealed the room of the portal, hit it, and made myself clear. But now I'll keep it. If something does end up happening, and someone in my bag is trying to get into it, and you help that, I'll be coming for your head.